everyone, we're back. This lice infested suitcase. I've had it since I was at the Flemington Institute. I, my name is Miss Guy Teenager, and we are playing some remothered broken porcelain. So, I don't know what is implied by the old cinema room. But I do remember where they watched that film. I just can't remember which place it was. But I remember what the hallway looked like. It was one of those like U-shaped hallways and there's t only two of those. There's the one that's here, near here, which seems like it's not it. And then there's the one by where I had the um, chase scene with Andrea in the laundry area, way back towards the beginning of the game. So it's gonna be in one of those two places. Can only be in one of those two places. Is it here? Doesn't look like it's here. So I guess I'll look at the other one. Cause I honestly can't remember. I remember the cutscene taking place in a hallway that looked sort of U-shaped like that. And these are the only two I can remember. Okay, no Andrea. Good. Okay, well if there's no Andrea, fuck it, I'm running. <laughs> Nobody's gonna stop me. Then, uh, I... It's not here. Okay. Hmm. Then where would this film be? Because I assume it's the film that they watched when they danced. It's got to be in one of these. Okay, that's locked. I <laughs> Fuck, it's locked. But why? Oh Jesus fucking Christ, Andira! What do we have here? Shouldn't you be cleaning room 212? Of course. And I am. It's just uh, I'm covered in blood. That, do you by any chance have a key for the cinema room? Ashman asked me to clean it up a bit. That's the least you could do after the mess you made. Excuse me. You right. <laughs> I'll be She's not a demon yet. I'll come back to finish off room 212. <laughs> I can't help you. After what you did, Mr. Ashman insisted that no one else was to have access to the cinema room but himself. For what you did, they he didn't do anything. Key, and I believe he's taking a nap in his room right now. I'll be quick. Let me speak with him. Young lady, don't make me say it again. Go to room 212 and do your job. She's acting like a stalker. She's not acting like nice Andrea anymore. She's even stalking around like she's evil Andrea, but she's not covered in moths like evil Andrea. Maybe if I go to room 212, she'll... I... I have to hide and try not to make a sound, at least until she's here. I assume that that's Ashman's room. So maybe if I be a little sneaky sneaky, a little hidey hidey, just a little bit, I talk to you guys saying hello. How is your day? My day is going well. I'm trying to finish this game up so then I can get back to finishing Dead Space. Because now I can play it on PC. I have all three of them on, um, all three of them on PC because they went on super sale and I got them for like five bucks. <laughs> so I ended up getting them and I streamed me playing through to where I am in the Let's Play. So once I'm done with this Let's Play, I'll be freed up to finish Dead Space. And then finally we can have a new Let's Play. Uh, I don't know how long it's going to take Andrea. Because I feel like that's the room I need to be in. Seeing as she unlocked it. And that's usually how this goes. Even though I'm stage whispering, which isn't really all that quiet. It's also really painful in my throat because I'm bad at it. 
Okay, that's nothing I can do with that. Bleach? Can I throw some bleach at people? Oh dear. She's a... She's still in there. And I'm pretty sure that's Ashman's room. What happens if I go back to room 212? Honestly, what happens if I go back to room 212? Because that's what she asked me to do. Okay, this is room 212. Which is my room. Why is she asking me to clean my room? <laughs> my room is fine. I... So I guess I'm gonna have to attack Andrea or something. Oh, right. He hurt me! Wait, who hurt you? Who hurt you? Do I have a stalker? Did I have a stalker and not realize it? No, no I don't. Hmm. Well, Andrea is in there, but I need that fucking key. Can I throw something at her? Are you just gonna stare at me? Woman, I need to get in there. <laughs> Can we talk about this? I didn't do anything! I beg you! Go into 211. Oh, okay. <gasps> okay, so I have to trick Andrea by going into room 211. Maybe I should have paid attention. <laughs> okay. Now I know what to do. I was close. This one's 213. 212. Where's 211? Damn, now they know where I am. Of course they know where you are. Maybe I should have paid attention to my objectives. I wonder if it popped up to do that already. Two two one two one one. Wait, what? Trick Andrea. Go into room eleven. One. How do you trick Andrea though? Because if I see her. Sup. Fuck! I've been hurt. Yeah. Okay, but how do I trick her? Do I start the washing machine? What do you want me to do, game? I am confused. Start her sewing machine, maybe? That could be it. That sounds like an Andrea thing to want to look at. Seeing as that's where she was at like the entire beginning of the game. Or fuck with her birds. Maybe that's it. No? There's a milk carton. Of a missing girl. 
Apparently this isn't either. Huh. I'm confused as to what it means by trick. I guess I'll figure it out. I'm sneaking. Damn it! I guess there's gotta be- s Wait, maybe I can use the moth power. Maybe I can use the moth power. There we go. I just want to Damn go it! <laughs> okay, that didn't work either. Okay. Where's this key? I have to make sure I don't get caught. Okay. I am disgusted by you and all the girls of your generation. Rude. The key's gotta be in here somewhere. It has to be. It has to be in there somewhere. Have they completed their chores? Obviously not. Rude. Alright, let's try it again. I feel like she's not gonna leave this room. It would be best if I just told him I don't work with crybabies. Okay. Now I can have a look around the place. They mustn't find me. Okay. Well, I grabbed the key, right? Yes, I got the key. Cool. Bye, bitch. <laughs> she just kicked me out. <laughs> and I still have the key. Okay. Sure I can. You're okay. fucking stuck in that room. I have room. to find the film before saying goodbye. It was here. I'm sure of it. I. Maybe a screwdriver. No, I want that. It's better. Okay, film, film. Gotcha. Before saying goodbye. Excellent. Now I just have to get the fuck out. No, 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 no. no. Hi. It's all your fault. This, my dear. No, no, you fucking Not won't. Stop her. And it certainly won't be stuff like this that is going to stop her. Sure will. And it's all your fault. You helped Gloria with it, breaking Wyman's loop. You asked me to do that. You were the ones who gave Gloria this power. I mean, true. Don't you understand? This doesn't only concern Lynn or me. This concerns everyone. It's useless. Your sister is controlling us like puppets. As did Wyman. I mean, true. Waking up Lynn from the limbo. This is the only way we can get rid of her. Gloria will only grow. She will continue to grow until she's gotten her revenge. I mean, she, she kind of deserves of her revenge. revenge. That same revenge which is consuming every cell in your body. My mother. She never loved you. Richard Felton, my father, is the only one she Felton. ever loved. Yep. That thing. Th that's the rude. Stock. I am your father. No! Richard is and always has been. Regardless... Of his gender. Hello. Who cares? He brought me up. He was a great father. You're only a child. Then why did you run away? Or a laughing stock. A ridiculous child. Why don't you go play with your dolls? Keep your nose out of these things. Why don't you behave like other children? Play hide and seek. You're not her father. You're roses. just the person who raped yeah, her dad. Let's do that. Fuck you. For all time's sake. Damn, now they know where I am. Um, I'm trying to run. Okay, yeah, we're out. Okay, I have to return to the basement and play this film on the projector. Do it! Get out! Get the fuck out of here! We gotta go! We got shit to do! Burn this place to the fucking ground. Yeah, boy. Okay, into my room. Into here. It's kind of weird that the sacred passage was in Jennifer's room. This is a little sketch. Not gonna fucking lie. Oh, whoops, that's the wrong button. Oh, Barstan's still in here. 
Oh, porcelain's still in here. I forgot about porcelain. <laughs> Okay, so I have to play the film in the projector room. <laughs> oh, fuck me! <laughs> Hi, bitch! Rude. Get him! We gotta go. We gotta, we gotta go. We gotta go? We gotta go. We gotta go. Wait, no, fuck! I'm gonna get- I'm dead! <gasps> Shank? <laughs> Gross. <laughs> I ain't game, where are you gonna put me? <laughs> That's kind of bullshit. I got teleported across the room. I'd have been able to get out if I hadn't been. I- Okay, we're just gonna wait. <laughs> He's obviously gonna come in here. I'll go past me and I'll run past him, throw the thing to the projector, and then we will go get Lynn's dumb ass. Once he's done wasting my time. Come on. I know you're there. Oh god. I have to find Lynn. We know where Lynn is, dear. It's fine. Just chill your jets. Fine. Hope I don't die this time. Okay, he's not there. <laughs> no, he's uh, right the fuck sure there. He's right the fuck there. Okay. <laughs> we'll just throw him on a loop to loop. Unless I can go in here. Ha! Bye, Felicia. Bam! <laughs> Done. Now let's get Lynn and get the hell out of here. Sure they don't find me. <gasps> Where did you come Move! from? Come on, come on! Play the damn thing! Play! Uh, no! <laughs> Stupid red nun. Enough! <laughs> oh, I'm Lynn now. Thank you. Aight. Uh, we gotta go! Oh, whoops. Uh, okay, I skipped another cutscene on an accent because I thought I was supposed to struggle. Cool. Let me out. Can I break out? Can I break this? No. I can't seem to get out. I... Oh. Okay, sure, let's use a crowbar. <laughs> Kinda surprised she was able to beast that. It's Eliza? Excuse me? Oh, wait, if she's Eliza and she's a nun, oh, that blinded her. Cause bright light. Is that Eliza? You, you, all this time, it's all because of you! Rude. Jesus! Well, bye, Andrea. Uh, not coming back from that. Ashman, what the fuck? Sister. That's your sister. That's incest. It was all their fault. The Feltons. No, you you raped the Mr. Felton. You're an asshole. Gloria, do you still believe it? Do you still believe this bullshit? You're lying. Bullshit! Tell her, Ash. Tell her. It was you who wanted to burn the place down. I mean, Tell it her. is. Tell her why. Because despite the large doses of phenoxyl. She began getting her memories back. Oh shit! Isn't that right? Memories of you harassing her. You were only a little girl at the time. It was Lynn. She's the one who started the fight. Uh-huh. She betrayed all I mean, she did. You have a choice. You tricked her. 
drugged her and forced her to do it. Gloria, you believe me? Don't believe him. Don't believe him. He's not worth it. Yes, yes, don't believe him. Don't believe him. Moth! Yes! Get him! Get him, Gloria! Get him! Oh, oh, that's how he got his face fucked up. What? I thought he would have. I got. That he got it fucked up in a fire or something. No, the moths fucking ate him. Jesus! Jesus fucking Christ! And that's how he lost his arm. I. <laughs> okay. That's a little gruesome. Don't know if moths can even cause that kind of damage. Are all responsible. All of you. Um, no, that's not how this works. That's not how this works at all. Lynn! <laughs> yeah, boy. Wait. Is Lynn able to control Porcelain now for some reason? So Gloria's blaming all of them. Oh shit. Get him. Get her. Get her. Get her. I mean, we, kn we know she doesn't die. We see her in the first game. Gun. Stop it! No! Fuck! No! Okay. I mean, Gloria really doesn't deserve to die. At least not at this point. <laughs> Gloria really doesn't deserve to die at this point, honestly. Gloria's had a shit life. <laughs> she got- she was sexually- Assaulted and molested and probably raped by her brother. And her parents' response to that was to send her to a fucking convent. Like, what the fuck is this game? What is this story? What is it? I don't- I can't- ah. I hate- We have to be near the end. We have to. We have to be near the end. This has to be near the end. It has to be. Oh shit! Rebel against Gloria. Use porcelain to kill her. She hardly deserves it, though. She need Gloria doesn't deserve to die. She deserves therapy. Where you at, bitch? Where you at? I see you. I see you. I really shouldn't kill her. Well, she didn't go that way. Hi, bear. They want to control me. They want to control me. No, we don't want to control you. We want everybody to go free. I... There you are. Come here, Gloria. Apparently the game wants me to kill you, even though at this point, at least, you've been shown to be a victim. No, she's not that way. Did she go in here? Alright. Wait, are you in the closet? They really thought they no. had found a solution? Maybe. After the mess they made? I don't know why I keep attacking every time I go through a door. Where are you at, Gloria? Where are you at? No, seriously, Gloria, where are you at? <laughs> Gloria, I need to stab you. Is she down here? No. Gloria! She's gotta be around here somewhere, right? 
I completely lost her dumbass. <laughs> Oops. Gloria! Gloria, I need to stab you. <laughs> Come on, Gloria! I just want a hug. I just want a very spiky, uh, spinal column filled hug. Come on. Come on, where are you at? I got a, sp I got a spinal column for you. That you off it, that you use against Lynn in the first game. So... Hey, you in here? Can't go in there! I... Man! <laughs> this is so weird! This game is bizarre! Dude, where did she fucking go? She vanished! <laughs> what kind of endgame is this? I don't even. The red nuns were used as oh. lab rats and then burned alive to bury the evidence. I hear her. Why would you go away your position like that anyway? Oh fuck, there she is! I come I went in here. I went in here and I just fucking missed her. Oh, <laughs> uh, maybe I'm the nun going blind. Come here. Oh, fudge nugget. Get back here. We can't. We can't leave. Yes, we can. Yes, we can, Gloria. We're gonna leave. Uh, not to me. Uh, you hurt. Uh, you hurt me. Yes, I did. You didn't really deserve it. I kind of feel bad about this. I kind of feel bad about this. Well, so you're not putting on much of a fight, woman. I come at, come at me. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I found you. She's just a girl, like many others. Is she though? She can't help us. Wait, what? Oh, I actually skipped a cutscene because I thought it was a quick time event. <laughs> God damn it! They shouldn't make it that easy to actually skip cutscenes. I mean, this would have been fine. The red nuns were used as lab rats. They were. Uh huh. And you shouldn't be blaming Lynn for that. She really didn't have a choice. Like, abuse brain is a thing. Hi. Rude. Get her. Get her. I mean, I don't want you to get her, but get her. You're not like them. You're not like them. Well then. You used to be my sister. Hey. You did it. You. She didn't have a choice. You betrayed us all. Lynn. It doesn't matter how. We have to go. Or when. But I won't be satisfied until you'll all be dead. Lynn! I'll we have to go. By killing your parents, Celeste. Which is what happened, which is the first game. So that goes directly into the first game. That's fucked up. That is fucked up. Like, Gloria is directing her anger at the wrong fucking people. Holy shit. I mean, maybe she should direct her some of her anger at Felton. Obviously. But the two she should be directing her anger at are her brother Ashman, her fucking parents, and Wyman. Oh, hi. <laughs> promise me that you'll put an end to this. I'm not going to promise anything. That you'll put an end to all of this. I want you to shoot me. Promise me. 
Tom, it's me. Okay. <laughs> She's. Okay. Why you always lying? Why you always lying? <laughs> but things got out of hand. You don't say. And you know, Gloria kept her promise. Her thirst for revenge was not quenched. But Jennifer managed to run away. Mm hmm. I know that she's somewhere in Sweden now. Yeah, and Gloria's dead she's because right. Rosemary killed her in the first game. She's a writer game. or something like that. Her publications are signed under a pen name. How many other people? What do you mean? Before you successfully found that Jennifer and brought her to the Ashman Inn. How many before her? How many girls did you suspect to be the mother at Garantia? To then end up living under porcelain's mercy. Oh shit. <laughs> How many? They were simple mistakes. I do <laughs> How many simple mistakes? Fuck off. <laughs> Fourteen. Fourteen altogether. You motherfucker. <laughs> God, I hate these men. <laughs> you will shoot me. Oh, you. Right? <laughs> he wants me to shoot him. This man is evil. This man is irredeemably evil. He is a child rapist. He is an adult rapist. He's a transphobe. And he helped murder 14 girls and tried to kill me multiple times. You deserve far worse. He deserves to live with his you deformities. To by living in agony, <laughs> as I did for the past 19 years. Fuck this guy. Lord, fucking Lord, you brought me. <laughs> yes, but Ashman, dude, I am petty. I am. Such a petty person. Nah, he gets to live with it. Fuck him. Well, now you know where uh, where where Lynn is. You should you should go hang out with her. I mean Jennifer. You know where Jennifer is. Go live with Jennifer. Go live with your babe. I ship him so hard. <laughs> Yeah, this this game is fucked up. Oh, this game is fucked up. I ship Lynn and Jennifer very hard. They escaped! Yay! What do you mean you can't? You guys have to go live your lesbian dreams. I have to go back. I have to return to my parents. What about the contest? I'll be there. I promise. She was not. Spoiler, she was not there. <laughs> <laughs> promise me. I promise. Sh spoiler alert, she broke her promise. <laughs> yes! <laughs> I was right! <laughs> it's gay and I love it. <laughs> oh, this is yours. What an odd name for a violin. <laughs> Read Aww. Rosemary. Red Rosemary. <laughs> I prefer Reed. <laughs> That's where she got her name from. Now give it back to me at the theater. Now you have no excuses for missing the performance. I'll see you there. <laughs>
No, she won't. Promise me! We'll see each other at the top of the world! No, you won't. Because as we learned in the first game, Jennifer went was at home and Gloria used the hypnosis and the phenoxyl to mind fuck her dad, Felton, into killing her mom and trapped them in the house and tortured them. Jennifer escaped that. We didn't see how, but she did. I didn't keep that promise. Yeah, you don't fucking Oh, it's it is Jen Jen. I returned to my parents Hi, Jennifer. the following day. The Feltons. Gloria followed me shortly after. She managed to subdue them. She got her revenge. I ran away again, leaving everything behind. But why didn't you go back to your lesbian lover? I'm sure that if I hadn't, she would have killed me. And then, we just left there waiting for you. Madam, how did you come to know about this whole story? Did Rosemary, Lynn, try to contact you? No. She didn't. What? I think that as long as she knew that I was safe and I had forgotten everything, nothing else mattered to her. See, that's... I feel like we need a third game. I feel like we need a third game. To explain. Last year. To explain all of this. Yes. Am I speaking with Celeste Felton? Who are you? I'm calling on behalf of Miss Lindsay. She is very weak now and has asked to see you. Aww. She let her live out her life, but they could have been together. Game, what the fuck? Game, what the fuck? <laughs> Gloria was dead. Everybody else was dead. Lynn could have gone and been, been with her. What the fuck? I mean, that's how she learned about everything that happened, obviously. I am salty now. Y'all teased us with lesbian romance, and then you're like, nah, they just decided not to contact each other for 40 years. Shit. Or however long. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Jesus fried chicken. <laughs> Teases us with that. It's like after after either killing or letting Ashman she live. Left. left. Died. Obviously. Old age and stuff. But. Lynn could have totally gone back. Like when she, when she figured out where jennifer was and that she was a writer and everything from ashman she could have been like lynn was right when he said lynn was wyman's inheritance and the only thing that he left her she was had alzheimer's his alzheimer mm. this is from her That's sad. This game is sad. <laughs> this game got really sad. <laughs> but still, like, Lynn totally could have been with her. Because, you know, yeah. There's the music. Oh, this is all the stuff that I found. Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, it's all the missing people that I found. Shit, son. Heyo! Oh, that's like all like the notes that I found in the game. My older sister. My older sister. I was only two years old when. Oh. When the last of the other Jennifers. The last one before they found the real Jennifer. I've been. Sixty-four. Sixty-four years old. She was one of the other Jennifers. One of the 14 gone missing. Kidnapped. Killed. Before they successfully found the right one. 
me. Well then. <laughs> Lynn never managed to come to terms with it. For all these years, she held on to my memories, her own, and those of the other victims. That's fucked up. <laughs> that is, uh, that's fucked up. I know she went back to the top of the world many times. The music that they wrote. Hoping that maybe one day my memories might resurface. Oh, so she she did go back to try to hope that her memories would surface. See, I feel like we need a third game to figure out how the fuck Gloria managed to uh, screw over the Ashmans that badly, because I feel like we're missing something. <laughs> Shaky as fuck, but I'm, it makes me want to cry. That ending. <laughs> oh man, Gloria did not deserve to go the way she did, in my opinion. Uh, but I get why she ended up going that way. Oh my god, <laughs> it's fucked up. It's fucked up. This game's fucked up. Right. So they never got to be together. Unless that last cutscene there in the end implies that Jennifer was lying to the dude in saying that they did see each other again and that they were hiding their lesbian relationship. And that's how I'm headcanoning that. I do not care if the game says, <laughs> technically says that that's not true. That is how I'm headcanoning it. Because there is not really any reason that Lynn wouldn't have been able to go back to Jennifer despite... Not counting the fact that she didn't have her memories, but she could have helped her remember. If she was waiting for her memory to resurface, she could have helped her along a little. <laughs> you know? I mean, she's gotta do something. I just wanna see a lesbian romance, okay? I mean, I'm asexual, but I love seeing representation. I. Okay, there we go! Oh, I got an achievement called The Keeper. I guess that's what Lynn became for Jennifer. Like, the keeper of her memories. That's still sad. I'm sad. I have to go to bed because I have to work in the morning. <laughs> anyway, that was Remothered Broken Porcelain. Janky, but really fun. My name is Miss Carla Tanager, and I'll see you all in another Let's Play.